Yo, what's going on? In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to change the turret damage to dinos on your Arc PS4 server. So stay tuned. It's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long. If you want to get your Arc PS4 server set up in minutes instead of messing around in the Nitrado expert settings for hours, then go to arcps4servers.com forward slash settings. Here you'll find downloadable settings codes that you can easily copy and paste to the expert mode settings of your Nitrado server and get your server set up ASAP. And if you want to get more players on your server and grow your community, then you can add your server to the site by going to arcps4servers.com and grow your community today. Yo, what's going on? I'm Jay Carter Ray from ArcPS4Servers.com teaching you how to be better. And if you host a boosted server and you've raised the dino levels, then turrets aren't going to do much to those dinos. You'll find very, very strong Bruntals that can soak up a bunch of turret damage and that sort of stuff. So you may want to scale up the turret damage to kind of match the scale up of the dino levels on your server. As far as I know, there's no way to change the turret damage to players. So if you know how to do that, then leave a comment down below and I'll, I'll test it out and see if I can find it. But this will allow you to change the turret damage to dino, so at least you've got something there. So let's go into normal settings, first of all. And I'm no longer going to be scrolling down in these tutorials. I'm just going to type in the setting up here because it's just easier for me and it's easier for you. There's no need to be scrolling all the way around your settings. So type in turret up here. And then if you scroll down, you'll see the, the dino turret damage multiplier. Now, this is the amount of damage that the turrets will do to dinos and by default it's at number one so if you change it to something like three then it'll be three times the damage if you change it to five it's five times the damage it will be more powerful the more you go up if you want it to like just leave your dinos alone for some reason then you can put it to 0 0.1 and it won't do a lot of damage but I, I wouldn't suggest that i don't know why anyone would do that but here is where you change it and then you just want to click save and then you can restart your server when you're ready. But if you want to come and do an expert settings, then let's go in here. You need to be in the game any file. And if you're using one of my codes from arcps4servers.com, then you just need to go to line 297 if you haven't made any customizations yourself. Or, you know, it's, it's not far from the bottom. You just need to come and scroll up. And there it is, Dino turret damage multiplier it's near lay egg interval multiplier near the auto pve timers which don't work as far as i know and their dino harvesting damage multiplier and disable loot crates and stuff like that so as you can see on this server i've well on my servers i basically have the dino turret damage multiplier on 3.5 because that's balanced with the levels on my server, which is max dinos go to level 360. So here you just want to change this value. So we'll change it to seven and then you click save changes, wait 10 minutes and then restart your server. If you don't know how to use expert mode, go and check out my video that shows you how to do that. And yeah, Bob's your uncle. Now you are done. I hope this video helped you out. If you've got any other questions or any other videos you'd like me to make, please leave those in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching and liking and subscribing. I'll see you in the next Arc PS4 server tutorial. Peace out. If you want to rent your own Arc PS4 server, I recommend renting one from Nitrado. Go to jcartarray.com forward slash Nitrado and use the coupon code jcartarray for 10% off. Now, if you go through that link, it does help out the channel. So please definitely do that. I use Nitrado servers for hosting my servers and it's also the official provider of Arc PS4 servers. So definitely go to jcartarray.com forward slash Nitrado and use code jcartarray to get 10% off your Arc PS4 server. It's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long. So all this warmth I share with you.